General Westmoreland took command of U.S. forces in Vietnam in 1964 with a mission to prevent the spread of communism, but his strategies and the escalation of American involvement in the conflict remain controversial. Westmoreland believed in the search-and-destroy tactic, aiming to locate and eliminate enemy forces. However, this approach led to high casualties and public opposition. The general also requested an increase in troops, from 75,000 to 525,000, sparking debates about the war's purpose and cost. The Tet Offensive of 1968 brought further controversy. Despite intelligence warnings, North Vietnam launched a massive surprise attack on South Vietnam's major cities. The offensive resulted in heavy U.S. losses and shattered the image of an imminent American victory. Westmoreland's leadership during the Tet Offensive faced criticism. Some argued that his focus on body count and attrition, rather than protecting key territories, left South Vietnam vulnerable. Moreover, Westmoreland's optimistic assessments of the war's progress, presented to the American public, were later questioned. Declassified documents revealed that he had been aware of the growing strength of the Viet Cong and the limits of U.S. progress. Westmoreland's tenure as U.S. commander in Vietnam was marked by escalation, strategy shifts, and controversy. The impact of his leadership continues to be a subject of debate and